COVID-19 days here in Switzerland, I've been panic buying quite a lot. Toilet paper too, you cannot find it here anymore now. But while I was buying pasta, vegetables, bolognese sauce, Swiss people were buying other kinds of food. What they were buying? Well, let's see it together in the second episode of Swiss Foods. The first type of food that Swiss people are buying during these quarantine days is something that they eat quite often for breakfast. Bichet muesli. Bichet muesli is a cold oatmeal dish based on rolled oats and other ingredients like seeds, grains, nuts, fresh or dried fruit. This mix can be eaten with milk or yogurt. It has been developed in the 1900 as food for the patients in the hospital, but is nowadays one of the most common foods that Swiss people eat for breakfast. You can find different type of ready-made biche muesli at the supermarket like this one, biche muesli with berries. It contains yogurt, fruit, berries and cereal. This is not a super healthy version of Bichet Muesli. It's way better when you buy the Bichet Muesli in a package like this one and then you mix it with fresh yogurt. This is more granola but you have a really only oatmeal based Bichet Muesli. But this one is actually very very good. One of the most I believe bought thing here in Switzerland during these coronavirus days Rösti Rösti is a typical Swiss dish based of potato in a form of a fritter It has been invented in the canton of Bern and it was commonly a breakfast dish but now it's actually eaten any time of the day I bought two kind of Rösti This is normal Rösti and this is Rösti with speck so I think I will eat this tonight. After eating roasty, for sure you will be very thirsty. Why not drinking a mezzo mix? Mezzo mix is a Coca-Cola product which was actually invented in 1973 in Germany, but is very popular here in Switzerland too. It's a mix of Coca-Cola and orange soda, and in Switzerland it is also known with the name Spezi. I have a very funny story about it. When I was working in McDonald's, Spezi was not on the menu, and then this guy came and he asked me, can I have a Spezi? And I was like, Eh? It's a very common drink here in Switzerland. I have never seen it in Italy before actually. A lot of people like it and you know what? I like it too. It's like your mouth has no idea what is going on, if it's orange soda or if it's cola. Another dish that is very popular here in Switzerland Spätzl. Spätzl literally means little harrow. It's a type of pasta made with fresh eggs. This type of dish is very popular in Germany, Switzerland, Austria, Hungary and Tyrol in Italy. You know actually the first time that I eat those was in the city of Bolzano, Bözen, which is in Italy in Tyrol and is actually very very good. You have different type of spätzli um, this one uh, are a little bit bigger ones you have very small like tiny and long ones and then you have green ones which means they have spinach inside or you have red ones which have red beet inside you have different type of spätzle and actually they are one of my favorite dish after your meal of course it's time for a dessert Berli Biberli Berli Biberli is a type of biscuits called Lebkuchen which is produced in the canton of Appenzeller. You see on the package is written Echten Appenzeller Berli Biberli, which means real Appenzeller Biberli. You need to go for the round one. These ones are actually very good. Fun fact, the recipe of this thing is kept secret and it is distributed by the airline Edelweiss before landing. I actually prefer flying with Swiss because they will give you chocolate. 
Of course, I save the best for last. When you go to a comedian night about Switzerland, there will be one thing that they will say about Swiss people, that they always have aromat with them. Aromat is a general purpose seasoning introduced in 1953. It's very popular in Switzerland and South Africa too. You know, Every Swiss people will have an aromat at home and a lot of Swiss people bring actually one of these with them everywhere they go, even at the restaurant. I mean, I don't know that for sure, but I have seen a lot of comedians making fun of Swiss people because of this. And be sure people, during this quarantine, I will not run out of aromat, which I actually never use, but I just bought it for this video. The problem is, I bought an entire wrong package for this video. I have now free package of aromat. I've heard a lot of stories of Swiss people putting aromat everywhere. And you know what I found at the supermarket? They sell boiled eggs with a little package of aromat on top so that when you peel the egg, you can put already aromat on top. Crazy what they think. Very salty actually. Fun fact about Switzerland, which I never seen in Italy, it's this already boiled eggs which are colored at first i really thought they were chocolate eggs but no they're just boiled eggs <sighs> that was a disappointment i hope you enjoyed this second episode of swiss foods thank you very much for sticking with me and watching my video if you are swiss let me know what you bought for your possible quarantine in switzerland Let's see what the Swiss government will decide and stay tuned for the next episode. Bye!